Welcome back, Mouseketeers. I am Christina Kay. If you are new here, welcome. We're gonna talk Disney because that's what I do best. <laughs> so if you're new, I have a lot of hauls that I'm gonna link some of my favorites down below. I recently just put up my entire ear collection. That was my most recent video. These, of course, were featured. Mouse Fitters, an amazing small shop on Etsy. Right after I filmed that video, by the way, I was talking to her. She has a sale going on, first of all, yes. They're cheaper than the ears in the parks, just putting that out there, and they're amazing quality. But also she's working on a bunch of different Marvel ears for Avengers Campus. Was supposed to open in July. I don't know when it's opening now, but she's gonna have a lot of Marvel ears, and she's making me Captain America. I'm so pumped. But let's talk Shop Disney today. The first half of this video is stuff that you can get at shopdisney.com. The second half is stuff that I got from a couple of trips ago that now that I'm cleaning my apartment because I got some time on my hands, I found a blue bag full of stuff that, well, we're gonna show today. So let's get into it. <laughs> Who doesn't love a good Disney mug? I'm gonna insert a clip of the mug that I recently got from my amazing boyfriend, but it's currently in the dishwasher. So I planned that out real well. This was the mug that he got though. This backstage Walt Disney Animation Studios mug. Both mugs were on sale. This was like probably like $5 though. So really good sales going on right now. This is something that I've had my eye on for such a long time, but it was so discounted. They put it down on sale and then they had an additional 25% off on top of that. So I was like, whoa, this is the time to do it. I think it cost me like $24.99. It's this amazing tea set that just makes me want to go on the mad tea party or at least go in that area. It's got two mugs that it comes with in the saucers and then this amazing guy. All right. How are the allergies where you are? Even though I'm not really going outside, mine are killing me. Okay, so we've got our little saucer and our teacup. And yes, it is just like the ride vehicle. We got the little door imprint there. I love the colors they chose for these. I mean, let's be real. Not gonna get me very far with tea. It's like three sips and we're done, but it's just really cute and I definitely wanna put this out on display. Do you remember when they used to have the bigger teacups? I don't think they still do that you could sell that. It's like all in one piece. It's a regular size mug and it's got the base too. I've got that, totally got that. And we got this color as well. My allergies are so bad that it's really um, messed with my hearing and even when I speak, so hopefully this sounds good. And then you've got, the selling point for me for this. Timothy Mouse. Ugh. That's I'm just dropping it. This just ugh, makes me want to be in fantasy land so bad. This is a functional teapot, but like I said, I think I'm just gonna use this as a display. And then we've got some clothing items because this is me we're talking about. This one was a gift from my boyfriend. We did a couple of different orders um, and this one was on his. It's just this very retro looking sweater. It's a one like shoulder um, top. So you just like wear a tank underneath it, but it's so retro looking, so incredibly soft. It is big, but it is awesome. Kind of reminds me of the patterns of like the plates and the napkins back in the day in the park you know what i'm talking about that was on sale this was also like super discounted um it was like 14 dollars for this animal kingdom tea just says animal kingdom it has some animal sketches in the background but it has the fab five and their safari outfits which every time i see them in their safari outfits i think of when the park opened in the 90s because like that's what all the merchandise had I just thought this was fun. And for the price, yeah. Really wanted the Disney World one in this. It is sold out, but they had my size in the Disneyland one. This is a woman's sweatshirt. On the front here, we just have this emblem, the Park Life Mickey with a flag that says Disneyland. On the sleeves, ugh, I'm always so terrible at showing sleeves. We've got the Disneyland castle. I conquered my fear and finally went on this, this last trip. I think that's supposed to be the Carthair Circle. 
And then we have the Matterhorn. Oh, there's totally a vehicle there. That's so cute. A ride vehicle. With people on it. The Disney World one has all four parks. Then the back has this super cute park life print with a bunch of ride vehicles and emblems of the park. So cute. And the hood, the fun continues on the hood with more of that print. We've got, you know, Big Thunder Mountain on there. We've got Buzz Lightyear. We've got Radiator Springs Racers. We've even got the Jungle Cruise. So cute, very soft too, and loving soft sweatshirts and hoodies right now because sweatpant life. Yeah. And the last part of this shop Disney order was this Disney Parks food backpack. I'm leaving it in the wrapper because it's actually a gift, but I wanted to showcase it because it's so cute. It's got popcorn, Mickey ice cream sandwich, Dole Whip. It's got part of a Mickey waffle cookies, macaroons, pizza. Um, it's originally 30 bucks, these backpacks. There's a Kiki Room one like this, a Haunted Mansion one, ear hats, like a purple and pink mini. It was discounted. So if you're into these kind of backpacks, it is discounted. There is a huge, and I mean huge, Shop Disney haul on the way, but I don't have everything yet, so we're just holding off. This is the first box that came, so we're showing this. Um, now, the second half is stuff that I have for my trip in December. Yeah, I know it's April. Don't judge. People are putting up their holiday lights, right, to spread some cheer, so why not spread some pixie dust this way, you know? So first we have a pin of Chippendale causing some trouble. This totally reminds me of the Disney sing-along song, the holiday one. Then there's this patch set. We have It's a Small World, Plant Mickey Ears, The Train, and my favorite, The Toy Soldiers. I love that part of the Christmas parade. Then I have the 2019 Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party Magic Band. The reindeer inside. Magic Kingdom 2019 and then it's got the castle and the little snow people and then on this side it says Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party we've got Mickey and Minnie decorating the tree I hope that's in focus oh I love a good magic band I miss wearing them goofy I mean when they have goofy merch Goofy is my favorite, and I had to get this pin from Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party as well. I love Chip and Dale and this whole thing. Look at that. So cute, that slider. And it's the pass holder pin. I think the rest are all clothing items. So the first is this Disney Vacation Club Welcome Home, Home for the Holidays. Then to go with that pass holder pin, I got the pass holder shirt. I mean, Goofy was on the merchandise this year. Even though this is a green and a color I don't normally wear, I had to have it. Very soft, very, very soft. Also from the Very Merry Christmas Party was this raglan tee, like the softest t-shirt ever with the logo for 2019. I try to get a shirt every year I go. I think the only one I didn't get was the first year. We all got this one in my family. It's got Magic Kingdom with a tree on the back. Really like the most ridiculously comfortable shirt. Then we have this Main Street Candy Canes Sweet Treats. I thought this was like cute to even wear here. Obviously not in April, like in December. And then last but not least, the Festival of the Holidays merch, which killed me this year. We've got this Chippendale Epcot shirt, which is oh, it's just so cute. It says Epcot International Festival of Holidays with the date. Pass holder. This was the pass holder tee. People were going nuts over this shirt. We were buying it at one of the booths and these people behind us were trying to get us to buy it. That's not how that works. And then, guys, 
you've been around my channel for a while, even if you've probably seen just a couple of videos, you may know I have a spirit jersey problem. There was no way I wasn't getting the Festival of the Holidays spirit jersey, because look at the bottom. I mean, come on. And I love this blue that's on here. I absolutely love it. And the back, oh, I'm nuts about the holidays. And then I don't know if you saw my ear video, but my friend Brittany made ears to go with this. Insert a clip here. Like, are you kidding me? Everyone was freaking out, not only over the spirit jerseys and the shirts because they did sell out, but the ears that went with it. Yep, that's my girl. So that's my kind of random, but very me uh, haul. Half shopdisney.com, half Disney Parks holiday haul. I hope you enjoyed it. I have a huge huge, I mean huge shop Disney haul soon that hopefully my boyfriend will be a part of. I kind of want him to guess what he thinks all the items are. Because hmm, we both know Disney merchandise pretty well, so I want to stump him. He doesn't know anything that I bought, and I kind of want to surprise him. It's like a reveal that you guys get to be a part of. So that's coming soon. I want to talk Pixar soon. I have more randomness or Christina-ish, Christina-ness, I should say, <laughs> coming soon. I hope you check out my recent ear collection and some of my other recent hauls that I've linked down below. And I will talk to you soon. I hope you are safe. I hope you are well. And I hope you're finding lots of ways to throw pixie dust into your day. A little vitamin D, vitamin Disney. Thanks for allowing me to be a part of it. I will talk to you guys soon. I'm Christina K. Have a Disney day. Sorry, this lighting is weird. This is like a weird time of day for me to be filming, but I don't want to close the blinds because it's sunny out for once.